Hi everyone. Welcome to Brain Booster Institute. So uh, if you're watching our channel at first time, so please subscribe our channel and please share it. Please like and comment. So let us go for a lesson today. So CBSC Mass 10 case study based questions. Case study based questions. This is second video. So let us go to the today's content now. So this is the base uh, case study uh, based questions. So uh, the question is, below figure shows the arrangement of desk in a classroom. Sujit, Bharat and MSD are seated at A, 3 comma 1, B, 6 comma 4 and C, 8 comma 6 respectively. Answer the following questions. One second, uh, one second I read the question. Below figure shows the arrangement of desks in the classroom. Sujit, Bharat and MSD are seated at uh, A, 3 comma 1 and B, 6 comma 4, C, 8 comma 6 respectively. Answer the following questions now. So uh, my dear friends and students, so this is the given figure. So there are three students in the classroom. So Sujit and Bharat and MSD. So these three are sitting in different places here. Uh, Sujit is sitting at A, so whereas 3 comma 1, so you can uh, uh, see in the figure, so 3 comma 1, 3 comma 1. So this is the question uh, we have made from the concept of coordinate geometry, so please kindly see it here. So and uh, Bharat is sitting at B, so at 6 comma 4, the point 6 comma 4 in the graph, so here is point 6 comma 4, so it is the Bharat now. And again, uh, MSD is sitting at C, uh, uh, which coordinates are 8 comma 6, so 8 comma 6. So this is uh, MSD's place here. So these three students are uh, sitting different place in the same classroom. So we need to answer the questions based on this concept, based on this uh, information. So let us see the questions, whatever he asked now. Let us see now. The first question is, See, children, see, if Lakshmikar sits at a point 6 comma 1, what is the distance between Sujit and Lakshmikar? So, uh, my dear students, see, actually in the question, Sujit and Bharat and MSD, but there is no Lakshmikar. So, there is another student, Lakshmikar, if he sits at a point 6 comma 1, what is the distance between Sujit and Lakshmikar? Now, let us go to the figure now. For example, so let us plot the point, uh, the position of the Lakshmika. So 6 comma 1. So this x axis 6 and comma 1 means. So the exact position of Lakshmika is here. So Lakshmika is sitting here. So here what is asking us question, uh, what is the distance between Sujit and Lakshmika? So as per the question, Sujit is sitting at A 3 comma 1. So Sujit place is 3 comma 1 and Lakshmikar place is 6 comma 1. So we need to find the distance between these two points here. It's a very simple uh, my distance here. So if you see then here, uh, if, uh, by seeing the figure also, uh, we can uh, directly we can say the answer and also by using the formula of uh, finding the distance between two points so we can see here. For example, the first one, uh, to, uh, to, take this, uh, to say the time, so first of all, let us see the graph now. So here is the Lakshmikar place and here is uh, uh, Sujit place here. So if you see then an A and uh, L, here, if you see my distance here, how many units are there? The one unit and two units and three units. So easily we can say my distance, so three units would be the correct answer. So that the distance between the distance between Lakshmikar and uh, Sujit is three units. So let us check by using the formula also. So let us take uh, Sujit uh, coordinates and Lakshmikar coordinates. So let us assume that x1, y1 and x2, y2. So we know pretty well about uh, the formula to find the distance between uh, two points in the uh, coordinate plane is. So uh, SL is equal to under root of x2 minus x1 whole square plus y2 minus y2 whole square. So let us substitute those values, my students. So under root of x2 is 6, 
minus x1 is 3 whole square and plus y2 is 1 and minus y1 is also 1. That's it. Now, then we can get my distance 6 minus 3 is 3 square and the plus 1 minus 1 is equal to 0. Now, 0 square is nothing but 0. So, the ultimate answer is 3 square my distance. So, we know the square root get cancelled, then what will be the answer? 3 units. So, we got the same by using graph also. So, so uh, what we can understand by solving this problem by using the formula, so we are, we are taking uh, less than one minute, but by using the graph, we can uh, answer this question within the seconds, my students, within the five seconds. So, we can save the time here. I hope you, are, you understood. So, if you have any doubt, please kindly message me in my WhatsApp number. So, this is my WhatsApp number. I'm writing here. So please message me 7989804600. So this is the first question. So let us see the next question. So which has framed uh, based on this concept now. Now let us see the second question now. The second question is, Harsha is sitting at midpoint of the position of Bharat and MSD. What is his exact position? What is his exact position? Already, the Lakshmi is a new student. He has sat, he sat here, and uh, we have seen the last problem. And uh, there is one more student, Harsha. Harsha is sitting at midpoint of the positions of Bharat and MST. If you see my students here, already we have seen this is the Bharat place, 6, 4. So here Bharat is sitting. And again, MSD is sitting at C. Already we have seen here. So uh, Harsha is sitting the midpoint of the positions of Bharat and MSD. So we need to find the Harsha's position is nothing but it is a midpoint of Bharat and MSD. Very simple my relationship. So Bharat uh, coordinates are 6, 4 and uh, uh, MSD position are 8, 6. So these are the coordinates of uh, Bharat and MSD. Now let us find uh, their uh, midpoint here. So we know the formula. So uh, before learning the formula, my students, now let us see the, uh, let us assume these coordinates are x1, y1 and x2, y2. The formula is x1 plus x2 by 2 means average of x coordinates and average of y coordinates means y1 plus y2 by 2. Now let us substitute those uh, values here. Now x1 is nothing but 6 and x2 is nothing but 8. Now 8 by 2 and comma y1 is nothing but uh, 4 and the 4 plus y2 is nothing but 6 by 2. So let us simplify students. 6 plus 8 is 14. Now 14 by 2 comma 6 plus 4 is 10 by 2. So there is a cancellation. So 2 times of 1 is 2 and 2 times of 7 is 14 and 2 times of 1 is 2 and 2 times 5, uh, 2 times of 5 is 10. So the answer is 7 comma and also means option B is an absolutely correct answer. And by using the graph also, we can see children. So if you see here, if you draw, if you draw a uh, line segment, which joins uh, Bharat place and uh, MS displays. So if you see uh, my distance here, so this would be the row two units, row two units, means same distance. So by seeing the figure, this would be the midpoint of Bharat and MST. So, if you take out uh, these coordinates here, 7, 5, easily we can see this. So, by uh, using the graph sheet also, we can find it here. So, the absolute answer is option B is here. Okay. I hope you understood. So, let us go to the next problem now. Let us go to the next problem. Third problem. Third problem, C. See here, what you observe here, in each and every problem, there is a new student is coming here. There is uh, each and every problem. So if you see my student, see, uh, let, uh, let us uh, read the question. If Jayan sits at midpoint of positions of Sujit and Harsha, what is the distance between Bharat and Jayant here? So in this question, Jayant has joined, uh, he is a new student. So let's see here. So once again, I read the question. Jayan sits at midpoint of positions of Sujit and Harsha. Already we know children, this is Harsha's position. So which is the midpoint of Bharat and uh, MSD. And already the Sujit is the first position. That is A. 
so uh, sujish is sitting here and arsha is sitting here and jayant uh, uh, sat the midpoint of uh, positions of sujish and arsha very simple to find the distance between bharat and jayant the first of all we need to find the midpoint of sujith midpoint of sujith and harsha and this would be the place of jayant and later we need to find the distance between bharat and jayant so bharat and jayant now first of all what do we need to find we need to find the midpoint of the sujith here and the next we need to find the distance between distance between distance between bharat and jayant bharat and jayant right so first of all now let us find the first one what is the first one my dear students the first one is the midpoint of sujith and arsha now i am writing the sujith the coordinates sujith coordinates are and 3 comma 1 as e e is sitting at the 3 comma 1 and uh, harsha is sitting at 7 comma 5 so that we have got in the uh, previous problem so harsha harsha coordinates are 7 comma 5 so now let us take children uh, x comma y uh, x1 comma y1 sorry and x2 comma y2 now let us find the uh, midpoint of sujith and arsha to find the jayant position now so therefore the midpoint of sujit and arsha is equal the we know the formula x1 plus x2 by 2 comma y1 plus y2 by 2 that's a very simple now let us substitute those values here x1 plus x2 is nothing but 3 plus 7 by 2 comma 1 plus 5 by 2 so very simple my reason. 3 plus 7 is equal to 10 by 2 now 1 plus 5 is equal to 6 by 2 now let us cancel 2 uh, two ones 2 times of 5 is equal to 10 and 2 ones 2 times of uh, uh, 3 is equal to 6 then we got here 5 comma 3 is the position of jayant which is the midpoint of sujit and harsha you got it so 5 comma 3 so where is the 5 comma 3 in the figure this is the 5 comma 3 in the figure so this is jayant place this is jayant place my students now the second one we need to find the distance between bharat and jayantia we know my distance here bharat and jayantia <coughs> bharat and jayantia so if you see my distance here so here the bharat, bharat is sitting here this is the bharat position and this is jayant position if you see this would be the distance between bharat and jayantia now let us find uh, distance between bharat and jayant my distance here okay now let's see Right, my dear friends, uh, uh, we got the Jayant position as, uh, as 5 comma 3 and uh, Bharat position already we know that. So, he is sitting at B and uh, 6 comma 4. Now, let us find their uh, distance here. X1, Y1 and X2, Y2 and uh, the square root of X2 minus X1 whole square. This is the formula to find the distance between any two points as we know that. So, directly I am writing it Y2 minus Y1 whole square. Now let us substitute those values now. X2 is nothing but 6 minus 5 whole square and the plus Y2 is nothing but 4 and Y1 is nothing but 3 and 4 minus 3 whole square. The final answer children 6 minus 5 whole square and 6 minus 5 is nothing but 1 and 1 square plus 1 square. Now that is equal to 1 plus 1 and that is equal to root 2. So I'm rubbing this 5 comma 3. So not to get confused. So the final answer is my distance root 2 units. So option B is an absolutely correct answer. The my distance C after getting the nth position, if you see then my distance, this is a square here. Is it square? This is a diagonal. So we know the children uh, in the graph 1 1 unit here. So the square is not the diagonal of the square is nothing but root 2 units to the each side here. So, as it is root 2 units the each side, so root 2 into side, now root 2 into side is nothing but 1 unit. So, therefore, my distance root 2 units. So, like this also we can do, we instead of using the formula, okay. I hope you understand and uh, let us go to the next problem now.
Right, children. So let us go to the next problem, fourth problem. Fourth problem. This is the fourth problem, my students. So if you see that the fourth problem is, let me read. Om again. The fourth problem. There is one more student has got here. Om is sitting alone at eight comma one. He wants his best friend John Paul. At midpoint of birth and him, what is the position of John Paul? What is the position of John Paul? Here, my dear students, in the fourth question, there are two students we got the new. So that is Om and John Paul, isn't it? So here, my dear students, see. First of all, uh, let me read once again. Om is sitting alone at eight comma one. So let us plot the point, the position of the Om, eight comma one. So this is eight and this is one. Uh, I'm taking another color, for example, pink. So this is the ohm position. Ohm is sitting here. Ohm is sitting here. Okay. So I'm rubbing Lakshmi cards for. So this is Lakshmi card place, right? So here is uh, ohm sitting here, which is eight comma one, and he wants his best friend John Paul at midpoint of Bharat and him. So my dear students, this is the birth position and this is the ohm position. So to find the John Paul position, we need to find the midpoint of birth and ohm here. Bharat and ohm. So here I'm drawing, uh, I'm drawing a line segment which joins birth and ohm. So so uh, the John Paul will sit midpoint of uh, will sit at uh, midpoint of birth and ohm children. So we need to find the midpoint of ohm and birth now. Now let us find now. So ohm coordinates are eight comma one, and uh, and Bharat uh, coordinates are six comma four. Very simple, my students. Now let us assume the x one comma y one and x two comma y two. So the midpoint, the formula we know, children, uh, John Paul position. So that is x one plus x two by two comma y one plus y two by two. Right. Now let us substitute those values now. Now x one is nothing but eight plus x two is nothing but six by two comma y one is nothing but one and y two is nothing but four and by two. Now let us see my distance. Uh, let us simplify this. Eight plus six is nothing but fourteen by two comma one plus four is equal to five by two. Now I think there is cancellation. We can cancel now. Uh, two times of one is equal to two. And two times of seven is equal seven, so that is equal seven comma. So five by two we can't cancel, so we can cancel, but we get the two point five. So even though it will be like this, seven comma five by two. So if you see, uh, if you see option children, seven comma five by two is not there. A option A seven comma five, option B is one comma three, option C is two comma one. So which is uh, we don't have a seven comma five by two. So option would be the none of this. It's very simple, my students. Okay. So and the next problem. Let us go to the next problem now. Right, children. Let us go to the next problem. So this is the fifth problem. What is the distance between Sujit and MSD? So Ali, we know my distance. The Sujit's position is here, and MSD's position is here. So we need to find the distance between Sujit and MSD. So uh, let us write the coordinate points of uh, uh, Sujit. Already we now children. Sujit is sitting at uh, three comma one. So this is uh, Sujit's position three comma one, and uh, MSD's position is eight comma six as he is sitting at C here. So eight comma six. Right now let us find the distance between these two points here. So let us assume this is x one comma y one and this is x two comma y two. The distance of Sujit and MSD SM is equal to the formula. I am writing the formula. X two minus X one whole square plus Y two minus Y one whole square, and uh, under root of X two is nothing but eight minus three whole square, and uh, X two minus X one X two is eight and X one is three, and the plus Y two is six minus Y one is one whole square. Now that's eight minus three is equal to five square, and also six minus one also five square by students. Now five square plus five square is nothing but twenty five plus twenty five, 
So we know that phi square is equal to 25, phi square is equal to 25. Now under root of 50. So this we can write as 50, we can write as minus 25 twos. So which is the perfect square. Now the square root of 25 we know students, that is phi and uh, root two is not a perfect square. So I asked is some writing. So the answer would be phi into root two units. So this is the final answer, option A. Excellent. So uh, that's all for this video. And uh, let us meet you uh, uh, for the next video, children. So please kindly support me uh, by subscribing our channel. So please kindly share it to your friends. If you are the teacher, please share it to your students, all 10 things. And uh, why? Because within the one week, we have that uh, uh, term one examination. It may help all the students, my dear students. Uh, thank you. Thank you very much. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.